Hi, I'm Amy. And I'm Steven. Fatigue may be something you have to deal with if you have CML. It can occur before diagnosis and due to your treatment. Before diagnosis, fatigue is due to red blood cells being low. These white, red blood cells are being pushed out by the high number of white blood cells in your body. In this study, roughly 10% of patients on nilotinib and imatinib experience fatigue. I dealt with fatigue for the first month of my CML treatment. One of the things I had to do was be patient and to build back up the things that I used to be able to do. So I like to exercise a lot, but I couldn't just go back to the same exercise I was doing prior to my diagnosis. I had to slowly over several weeks build up to, this, to the pace and time that I was used to. In addition, I would take naps, and as my blood counts came back into balance, things got better. Give your body time to adjust to the new medication, and hopefully your, your fatigue will go away. An important tip is to communicate with your doctor if, this can, if fatigue continues to be a problem. I was diagnosed with chronic myeloleukemia, CML, in 2011. I experienced a lot of different side effects from my treatment, which was an oral chemo pill called Designa, or nilotinib. I was on these pills for over eight years. Yes, for the first few weeks I dealt with fatigue, my work was nice enough to let me have an office that had a couch in it, and so I could go in there and take a nap, which I did every day for about an hour. I probably did this for about two or three weeks as I was getting used to taking the to sing the pills. Once I got used to it though, the fatigue did go away and I, didn't, I no longer needed to take the naps, which was a good feeling. Question of the day. What has been your experience with CML and fatigue? Comment below so we can all learn from each other's experience. If you want to learn more about CML and living a healthy life with CML, start now by subscribing and clicking the bell. Thank you for watching today. Together we heal.